we go here? No. Here? No, we have to go through here. What if we come back this way? And try to come across here. Okay, we take attrition there for some reason. There's nothing there. Hmm. Guess we have to. Okay, we need to go. We might not win this one now. <laughs> well, we can't leave. We can't leave by this. Well, we could leave by this river. If we can get on it fast enough. Yeah, we want to get out this way. <laughs> Oh, we can't move while we're uh, raiding either. No. Okay. And we still have the advantage. <laughs> Our champion Heralder ripped the head off of their their main guy. <laughs> wow. Our champions are so good, dude. There's somebody else coming in. Another battle immediately after, and more people are coming in. Holy smokes. We gotta get out of here, dude. We gotta get out of here. <laughs> Another daughter, okay. <sighs> sure. I don't think we're getting out of this alive, boys. I think we are stuck. Oh no wait, he's not an enemy. He is hostile, but he's doing something over here, so we're out. <laughs> oh, Frey is pregnant as well. That is good news. I can't believe we escaped that. Alright, let's see the details here. All right, none of our champions died, none of their champions died. Okay. The challenge. Hang on a second, challenge. Okay, one of their champions died in the second fight. With eight prowess. Oh, and count... Oh, yeah. The <laughs> he died by somebody ripping his head off or something. Can we see that? Yeah, had his head ripped off by Heralder. <laughs> wow. Okay, good. Serves him right. <laughs> What's up, Divine Sunderer? I'm not doing too bad, Santo. Not doing too bad. You know, Christian Vikings. All right. The challenge. I'm sparring with one of my soldiers, sweat beating on my forehead when I experience the uncanny sensation of being watched. Looking over my shoulder, I spot my chancellor, Don, who waves at me and walk over to greet him. We talk about our weapon practice for a while, trading tricks and advice. Just as I am about to leave for another round, Don's face lights up and he suggests we practice together. Okay. 82% chance that I destroy him <laughs> or I lose. Okay. Challenge accepted. Let's go. The sounds of swords clashing against mace echoes between the courtyard walls. All eyes are on us. Everyone wants to see their Jarl fighting his chancellor. The crowd applauds as I lunge, and their admiration makes me bold. Instead of pulling back, I attempt a new technique I have been practicing. The movements flow through me and into my sword as if we were one. Dan, or Don, is defenseless before me. Okay, we gain some prestige. He gains 20 opinion. We get martial lifestyle experience, and we get a one-to-practice duel. 
prowess up by one. Or I destroy him. <laughs> I gain 13 dread. <laughs> um... I'm not really hurting on prestige. Huh. Yeah, I think I'm going to show him not to challenge me again. Don't even try it, buddy. Don't even try it. Loss of control. Oh my god. Our steward is so terrible. Like, absolutely atrocious. Alright, let's disband. We got 82 and 82. I guess that's an okay raid, but, um, man. Aha, prisoners can be ransomed. For 100 gold. Yeah, I think we'll do that. And then Clementia for 10. You know what, let's, let's take a closer look at Clementia here. Oh, there's another one. Clementia, I want you to follow the Asatru gods. Okay? And this one... Um, okay. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. Another follower of the Asatru faith. Now, we got fairly hurt on that last raid mission. So, we might need to look for a weaker opponent. Wow. Um, over here is looking pretty... Pretty beefy. Except for these guys over here. Are these guys... How are these guys doing? 17, 17... Nothing, nothing, and nothing. It's so really uh, this one and this one are the only two that matter here. What about Ireland? He's pretty weak. Um, 15, 6. Nothing here. guys are weak and poor. That makes Ale Drinkerson very sad. Okay. Yeah, these are terrible places. <laughs> wow. Just no loot to be had in Ireland. Okay. Frankia would spank me if I go anywhere near them. How about these guys? Do you have anything on the coast that you would like to give to me? Uh, it's not bad. It's not bad. I think we can go here and make some decent money. So, Navarra. That's really far away, actually. So, we'll, get, we'll gather our troops. We'll let them restock here. In fact, we might want to increase the size of some of our troops. Yeah, I think that's good. When I can have another minute arms regiment, let's get some armored footmen in. Why not? Okay.
Do we have any... Okay. Ah, Freya presents me with a perfect little son. Newt. <laughs> uh, after an ancestor. No. Uh, Ormer. Solvi. I like Solvi. That's a good... Good Norse name. Or a good Asaturu name. Alright, let's check this kid out. He should be my heir. He needs to be my heir. So, Ail Ailson. Buddy, I got some bad news for you. I certainly do. I can't send him away. I can't try to murder him. <laughs> hmm. Wow. Okay. I have to come back to this. I'm not sure what to do about this. I want him gone and the new guy in. <laughs> Alright, the way of the sword. The endless clash of metal on metal. The chafing of armor. The sting of sweat. It is a dance that is as familiar as it is exhausting. To heft my sword. Attack. Dodge. Defend and repeat. Maybe it would do me good to practice my skills with another weapon. Uh, respected expert. Prowess plus two. Hmm. Yeah, we're going with prowess. That's just free skills. I'll take it. Yeah, we're at 31 prowess. I mean, we are a monster on the battlefield. Just by ourselves. Alright. Wifey really likes us now. Let's look at somebody else to sway. Oh, one of our champions is disfigured. Yeah, disfigured, wounded. He's having some trouble. Okay. Stu Haralder. Yeah, you're pretty good. Let's make sure you're happy with me anyway. <laughs> Okay, so we can have up to 1580 soldiers now. Very nice. Lost in thought, my son and heir, Ale, is an unusually calm child. When the others play their wild games, Ale often withdraws to some silent corner. He does not speak a lot, but I can tell he is always thinking about something. My pensive. Stewardship and learning. Isn't that what we want him to be? A steward? Yeah. That's perfect. Okay, keep it up. If I can't murder you or kick you out, then I would like you to make me some money. <laughs> oh boy. Well, let's see here. Jarldom of Sealand. Has all of. It's like um, all of Holland in it. Hmm. Sending my army to raid this place would be beneficial somehow. What? Yeah, they have 20 gold. Hmm. Do I really want to raid my uh, my neighbor though? Or would I rather keep taking Catholic treasures? Hmm. I think I kind of want to take Catholic treasures. Military strength, two soldiers. And you got some money as well. 
Okay, sure. We'll figure out where to go from there. So we're going to go to Strathclyde. All right. Raise all here. Okay, we are going to be raiding. Let's go. Where was it at? It was right here. Okay. Oh, that place is already raided. Okay, whatever. Maybe we'll hit up Ireland anyway while we're down here. guys down in this coastline aren't looking too too dangerous and they're uh, looking like they want to get rid of some of their money okay growing strong the weakness that has plagued my daughter since her birth has finally released its hold on her relief watches over me as I see Elizabeth running around with all the other children perfect she's no longer sickly that is excellent. We are not raiding this place because, yeah, it's already been raided apparently. Hmm. My contacts have sent me a tome written in some strange code. It's leather covers decorated with my mistress's symbols. I've only been able to decipher the first few pages so far, but they are deeply fascinating. Uh, I get one perk unlocked immediately. Hmm. Okay. Why not? What's this one? Hit and run. Okay. That looks pretty good. Excellent. So let's come down here. So Santo, I, you know, I would just keep trying to conquer everybody that's like bordering me, but there is this problem with um, with legality. So let's say, and it, it's also a problem with my diplomacy skill because I can only control three places myself, and I'm at that limit. But let's say I were to go and I captured his wife holy crap well let's let's take a look for a second and say I were to go and just keep going up this way capture all these guys well there's the problem with this guy if I go into his territory and I control like this area here for example um, Actually, let's let's take this for a better example. If I go down here along this southern coast, go into Shayland, and I I get like this far maybe, and I kind of stop. This guy, Jarl Sigurdur, Snake in the Eye, has a rightful claim on all this territory. Like this should legally be his, right? So unless I continue and just conquer all of his territory and make it mine so that I'm the rightful uh, leader there, then all the people are going to resist my control because 
I'm not supposed to have it. And they'd rather the other guy be in control. So I, I have to kind of think about what I'm doing as well. Now I got this guy up here at the very start of the stream because this is just one big giant duchy. It's supposed to be that. It's supposed to be one big duchy. Or Jarldom in this case. <clears throat> so this is fine. And now if I were to go up here and take like this guy, if I were to take for uh for def feel key will it really rightfully belongs to this guy because it's all part of this one big thing so they are split up a little bit but overall he should control this so unless i'm willing to just push my way all the way up through here and control all of this, it might be more trouble than it's worth right now. So anyway, back to raiding. Uh, oh yeah, uh, I'm going to go here. We'll take attrition there. Why don't we take attrition there? Let's go here first, maybe, and then slowly go up this way. I don't know. The attrition thing is really confusing right now. Because from my vantage point, I should be able to go from here to here. Nothing's really standing in my way. But no, I've, I've got to come. But if I come down here, same distance basically. There's no attrition, but if I went this way, there is. It's really confusing, to be honest. Now there's going to be attrition, so if I go here, no attrition. If I go there, attrition. It's really, really strange. I don't want to cross over into his territory. For sure. This guy's even more dangerous. Now this guy, if he's got some money, he kind of does. Right there. Now look at this. All this way and no attrition. Really, really confusing. Let's just take all this guy's money. All the sweet, sweet loots. There's not much here, four and four, so then we will have to leave for greener pastures. This one might be decent. It's not great. It's not great. but it could be decent and decent might just be enough you know decent might just be enough wow it captures wife and his daughter in, <laughs> in that siege okay uh, another perk we want to get down here so we're gonna have to go down this way not bad Yeah, not too shabby of a perk, but uh, could have been better. All right. Oh, we have something here. Give me 15 gold. All right, where's the other one at? All right, I want you to convert to... That's the true religion. Okay? Okay. 
Good choice. Alright, so this guy's sending his soldiers. We're just going to keep on keeping on until he catches up with us. <laughs> we might get away. Nope. He caught us, but that is to his detriment. Oh, we took a wounded champion, actually. Let's check this out here. Yeah. Sigbjorn is wounded and Don is wounded. But our big boys are still doing fine. to where we are full. Alright, they're coming back as well. Okay. Right, we took another wounded champion, so... We might need to get out of here at this point. Plus, we're full. Yeah, we're full. Let's head home, drop off our sweet, sweet loot. And we're good to go. All right. Alright, Heraldur swayed again, so we really don't need to sway him anymore. Let's see. Let's go with Elizabeth. She gave us some twins. Let's make her pleased to know us. Let's disband everybody. 128, 128. That's better than the last one, for sure. Now... Did we want to... Yeah, we really want to start building stuff here. Let's do a war camp here. Let's do... Where's my capital? My capital's down here. Let's do war camps here as well. They were... Oh, we have plenty of money to go around. Let's do another war camp here. And that is all three of our holdings so far. Okay. Got a little bit of stress. We could do with maybe a feast. I think we'll do that. Let's host a feast. And then we'll go raiding some more. We want to celebrate our successful raiding. Yeah, that's why they're called champions. Um, you know, if we were a feudal society, they'd be called the knights. But they're not. All right, cheery gathering. Welcome, friends. Uh, the feast is down here at the capital. There's only three people here. Me, my wife, and my concubine. <laughs> That's got to be the most awkward party of all time. Okay, so, my lord, the wine. We cracked open the next barrel. It has gone bad. It has all gone bad. Um, let's buy some more for the most awkward party of all time. Cool. <laughs> Hidden meaning. Okay, let's see. The other guests are laughing and chattering in the noisy hall, all two of them, making it hard to focus on the gruel in front of me. I draw lines and engagements in the greasy sludge as I think of ways to counter various battle plans. With my skirmishers harrying the carrot flank. <laughs> okay. 
Skirmisher damage goes up and toughness goes up. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh man, playing with our food. Figured out how to win a war. That's great. <laughs> okay, control's almost done here. Okay, guests are departing. 150 prestige. Everybody that was there. 20 opinion of me. Perfect. So. It says I can declare wars. Let's let's actually take a look here. Where would this one be? That is all of this. And that is all of this. So between those two, I can control all of this area. This guy, ooh. So, 1681 versus 1694, that's pretty fair, even. Jarl's, um, it would be this right here. Um, This one would be this right here. This would be that right there. So that's the one you were wanting me to go for, I think. That guy. Hmm. What about this guy? Okay. Oh, that's the one I looked at earlier. Okay. So this one... There's only the really only realistic one there. So he's got two allies. 1200, He's got... I mean, they would... They would defeat me, probably. Another martial perk. Envelopment. Okay. Oh, counter-efficiency up 25%. Very good. Very good, very nice. I think he would beat me in a fight. Because of his two allies, mainly. Um, okay, we have everybody available. Raise everybody here. We're going to go looking for some raids. Let's go back around this way for a change. See what's down this direction. They have already been raided a little bit. Sweden is actually not that powerful. Only 2,600 soldiers. 1,500 there. 650 there. 1,123 there. 960. Are you rich? <laughs> it does not appear so. Okay. What about up this way? Are you rich? Uh, not really. You know, we could just kind of go up this way. Yeah, we could just kind of start here. And work our way over. Raid loot zero. Okay, never mind. We're going to start up further. <laughs> we'll start here. Just go a different direction this time. A scheme at court. Oh, someone is plotting to kill my champion, Haralder. No. Haralder must not be touched. Alright. I must be the commander. Thank you. 